it is time to finish Ruby Volume 3. This entire volume has been the craziest Ruby has ever been. And these final two episodes are probably gonna be even crazier than the than the entire volume has been so far. Like I have such high expectations for these for, for these two two upcoming episodes. Like it's just that we're against such ridiculous odds and yeah. Ruby, you don't stand a chance against her. And you're up in the sky. <laughs> it's a ruby again. Running away again. Is that what you've become, my love? A love. Coward? Why are you doing this? You and I were going to change the world, remember? We were destined to light the fires of revolution. But you were going about it the wrong way, right? Consider this the spark. But yeah. I'm not running. That's great. Yeah, but Blake just doesn't stand a chance, right? He's still saved her. Before you've suffered for your betrayal, my love. What do you mean suffer? Well yeah. It's just that there are too many enemies. Like, it genuinely just never stops, and especially now with this dragon. Like, they, it's just summoning different Grim. Uh, yo! Yeah, slowly, everyone, like, the, our numbers are just dropping. Slowly but surely. We're just getting overwhelmed. Well, I guess now is a better time than any. Velvet! Really? Just make them count. What kind of crazy powers does she have? And what was her name again? Better time than any. Cause I call her Bunny Girl, but I know she has a name. Velvet. Velvet. This is bad. Well, I guess now is a better time than any. Velvet. Uh, yeah, Velvet. I think. Just make him. Let's see how badass she can be. Okay, if she has her own theme song. Then that means that she has some crazy hidden powers. What? That's Ruby's scythe. And that's wise. What? She's copying their moves and I was yang. And then this is Blake. She's also going to use a guess. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, we got I'm just listening to the music at this point. Wow. She is this strong? She can just copy moves and weapons? That's so OP! She's so much stronger than I thought she was. What's this? Wow, even Penny! <coughs> and those knives are sharp. Oh. Damn, yeah, it wasn't it was going too well, right? Oh, why? Summoning, 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 summoning. Did he summon something? Oh, and it's not just something! Look at 
this. It's so big. And she did a full summon a full thing. That's an arm and a giant sword. She has grown. Let's go. <laughs> That's so cool. And she gets a picture taken. Oh, that's so cool. They just keep coming. Exactly. And this girl has like ultra instinct or something. She just like moves in a way. So that she doesn't get hit. Little red, little red. You are just determined to be the Yeah, she's very male, persistent. <laughs> Especially with you. That's the plan. Oh. I mean, I just know that Ruby can't win this battle. Oh, and especially on the other side. I may be a gambling man, but even I know there are some bets you just don't take. He's not dumb. Like it or not, the people that hired me are going to change the world. You can't stop but them. I mean, are they gonna change it in a good way? I can't stop them. And you know the old saying: if you can't beat them, if you can't beat them, join them. Oh. I don't care what you say. That was actually a nice if move. That's one way to get rid of her. And now I'm so much more confident. Because Ruby can actually 1v1 one one this guy. And, I will stop you. and this music, is this new? And what about your scythe? Don't, don't, don't let, don't let go of your scythe. You need your scythe. Oh! You wanna be a hero? Then play the part and die like every other huntsman in history! Ah. As for me, I'll do what I do best. Lie, steal, cheat, and survive! Oh shit! That's a That's the end of his character? He gets eaten by a grim? But she can survive, right? Falling down. She can survive. No problem, right? The entire ship is just exploding. She has to hurry up, but she, yeah, she needs her scythe. Because without a scythe, she is useless. <laughs> She's still sniping mid-air. Ruby actually definitely pulled her weight already, and Kaiden! <laughs> Who is this? Oh. And these are his creations, and he is a cyborg. This area is secure. We need to. Oh? What do you mean? Why is he fighting him? Is he also under control? Oh, a scythe! Crow, this isn't my doing. What is he doing? Oh, wait, huh? Behind him? Oh! Oh! 
Wow. You idiot. I know you didn't do this. And he has a scythe. I didn't know that his weapon could transform into a scythe. So what now, General? Someone's done the impossible and gained control of my machines. And that enormous grim seems to be fixated on the school. Glinda, form up with the local huntsman and establish a safe zone here in Vale. We need to evacuate Beacon. Crow, I'm leaving that to you and my men. I still need to get to my ship. Well, your ship is coming to you. <laughs> Ruby! Hi, Uncle! <laughs> Ruby did so much more than I realized. Yes, Ruby like defeated the, the, the guy with the orange hair and you know he got eaten by, by a Grim. But she also crashed the ship. And and the like the thing the thing got destroyed that's like controlling all the robots. So now one of the big forces that we were against just got turned off. Hmm. That went better than expected. <laughs> Oh, there she is. Have you heard from Ruby? I mean, she's actually doing well. She went after an alpha. And some members of the White Fang. You look for Ruby. I'll meet up with Blake. I have a Blake is in a tough spot. Oh, but Cinder is like behind them, right? What is this place? It's a type of vault. You've been here before? What would this school need to hide? Oh, he's... What? I thought he was Who? losing consciousness, but yeah. John. Pira, get to the pods. Mr. R, if you'd like to help, you can stand guard here. Okay, turn around. Let's go. He's doing anything Let to protect her. We do nothing. You, Miss Nikos, have a choice to make. You, Miss Nikos, have a choice to make. I mean, she didn't run all this way for nothing. I feel like she's already made her decision. This is still scary. this world and deliver the justice mankind so greatly deserves I will make it my mission to destroy everything you love Blake, where are you? oh no she's now Adam is gonna target her starting with her that's so bad yeah I need and I'm not sure if Osmond can hurry up, but I feel this is just a, a computer I, doing its thing or the machine. I need to hear you say it. Yeah. Thank you, Miss Nikos. Oh, it's going a lot quicker than I was expecting. No, no, stand guard. I mean, John has no clue what's what's happening. So sorry. Is he just dead now? Oh my god. Cinder. Yeah, she's still after the power of the Fall Maiden. Oh my god. Now you have to stay away from him. Oh my god! Oh my god! 
Oh, so quick! Oh, oh my god, that gave me goosebumps! That gave me goosebumps! Oh, the machine turned off. Straight up an arm. And even elbow, I think. Oh! What? They're screaming that she has the power and she's inside and John, don't go. John, you will die. She has the full power of the fall maiden now. Find Glinda, Ironwood, Crow. Bring them here right away. The tower cannot fall. But I can help. No. You'll only get in the way. Yeah, you are not strong enough for an opponent like this. Cinder was already strong before receiving the power of the Fall Maiden. But now she's on a different level. And she's the one responsible for all of this. Why must you hurt me, Blake? Oh my god. My heart just skipped a beat. Because I saw it happening. And then I thought it was just like an after image or a shadow. Like. I saw this in. Oh. <laughs> I'm actually in track of what I'm seeing. Like everything is going wrong. Like what Ruby did was great. But like let's be honest. It does not really matter all that much. Especially with Cinder there. Cinder is going to be so strong. Like she is one of the, 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 the power, she has the power of one of the four, four maidens. Like she is probably the strongest person in the, or top four strongest people in the world. Like I'm not sure how strong Osbin is, but Osbin wasn't confident in beating her. That's why he, he you know, he needs reinforcements. Oh, he is so strong. He's definitely on the level of Crow, this if not stronger. Right beneath our feet. She was right about you. Such arrogance. It's the first time we saw Osman this serious. Oh wow, the next episode is a longer one. The next episode is 28 minutes. And this is going to be a, just a joy to watch. Because, I mean, you can only experience this story once. And I feel like this is one of the highlights of the story. And this is Osbin and Cinder fighting? Yes. Oh, she has all the elements. Wow. Like a, oof. He doesn't need- oh my god, maybe he does need backup. Because she literally has the, the power of God. Osbin is also really, really strong. Like, I mean, I, I was expecting it, but... It's crazy to actually see him fight. This is a mandatory evacuation. A safe zone has been established in Vail. Please, remain calm and listen to Atlas personnel. Ruby. Ruby, oh, I found you. Ruby, where are Don't you? Don't worry, I'm fine. What's going on? Yeah, but if they see Yang, then they're gonna be in shock. Twice? What is it? Oh. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. She's not dead, right? Dang. Who's this? She's gonna be okay. The soldiers have a ship ready to take you guys to Vale. But John and Pira are still missing. Ugh. What? Look, guys. That giant Grim keeps circling the school. Even the White Fang are pulling out. We all have to go. Now. We're not leaving. But do you not see that 
most of them can't fight anymore. This is the limit. This is their limit. They can't continue fighting. I'll find them. I'll find them and I'll bring them back. No. We will find them. Watch after Blake and Yang. We'll be back. You better be. And the dog is staying behind. I mean, can't argue with them. Okay, I think I have Glinda's number. Oh, where is it? Pira? What was all of that? I... Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, what about Osbin? But Osbin? There's no time. There's no way Osbin is actually dead. Get to Vale and call for help. Huh? What are you gonna do? Yeah, you can't hold her off. No. Like she dealt with Osbin oh, in a minute. Can't. Like like two minutes of fighting and she, she defeated Osbin. That means that you can like what? S save I mean how how long will you stand in a fight against Cinder? Not more than ten seconds. You saw how powerful she is. Exactly, John. You're right. I won't let you do. Oh. I was not expecting this. I'm sorry. But no, now she can really call. Oh, wait, stop. Stop. Kira, please don't do this. Damn. But she can't sacrifice herself. She is noble. She just went straight through. Is she going up or down? To Osman or Cinder? Damn, she's going up. It's Sean. Where are you? Weiss, please, you have to stop her. What? Pira, she's going after that woman at the top of the tower. She doesn't stand a chance. Sean, what are you talking about? But you guys about? also don't stand a chance. Don't worry about me. Please, you have to save Pira. We will. Are you okay? Ah! Yeah. Please. That's just pure defeat. He knows that he can't do anything. But he should get Crow or notify Crow. And the dragon is also at the tower. This is just getting worse and worse. Oh, damn. Ooh! She doesn't stand a chance. Like, I don't understand going after her, to be honest. Because it's basically the same as suicide. Make sure you can hold her off for like 10 20 seconds, but that's about it. Wow, she's doing a lot better than I was expecting. She's doing a good job. Oh, she's so much stronger than I was expecting. Excuse me? Destroying the weapon? Oh no, the dragon. Damn, I mean, 
but she was never gonna win. Yeah, I mean, no, she has the full power of the Fall Maiden. There's no way that she can defeat her. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I did not see this coming! But it's not enough. You know, I'm happy that Vice and Ruby are not there. Because they, 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 they also just don't send a chance. Oh. You can do this. She, yeah, she, okay. <laughs> I mean, we've done this before. Oh! Where did she get hit? I didn't see the arrow. Like, where, where is the arrow landing? I don't see it. I don't see the arrow. Is it in her leg? Oh, there it is. The roof. Ugh. It's unfortunate you were promised a power that was never truly yours. But take comfort in knowing that I will use it in ways you could never have imagined. Do you believe in destiny? Yes. Well, I feel like if you ask, if you answer that question, then you don't get, you still don't give the full answer because I feel like most people view destiny in like, I mean, I guess a similar way, but I feel like everyone has like their own way of viewing it. Oh! It's too late. I thought Rubus was gonna, was gonna save her. Oh! Disintegrated. And now Ruby's there alone with her? What? Will Ruby race a dragon? It's all right. I got you, kiddo. I got you. A scroll, but what was that power? <sighs> Nothing. Just turn it off. Without the CCT, there's no point. Communication down across the entire kingdom. No way to contact the outside world. And Ozpin's still missing. Ozpin's still missing, so... This is her waking up after, like, being unconscious for a little while? This is bad, Pro. Yeah, this is bad. Beyond bad. Ospin missing? John lost, uh, not John. Um, what's the girl that just straight up dis got disintegrated? She's gone. Yang lost an arm. Entire kingdom in chaos. Oh, that's the dad. Now we finally see him. For the first time, well, I mean, I guess we saw him once before at the start of this volume, but that was just in the background. Now we're finally seeing a good. We're getting a good look of him. Ruby, you're awake. What? Yeah, but what Nothing. was that power? Your uncle Crow found you unconscious. He got you out of there, though. He brought you home safe. Wait, Yang, is she all right? Uh, she's uh. 
she's going to be all right. I think she's just, I think it's just going to take some time. Yeah, she, I mean, she lost an arm. Like her entire thing was, oh, I want to fight. I want to, you know, enjoy, and, you know, she enjoys fighting. That's, that, that, that's what she does. But now she lost an arm. Now she can't really fight anymore. We're not on the level that she used to. For her to get used to things. She's too strong to let this stop her. <sighs> All this stuff was so crazy. I still can't believe it happened. What happened to the school? And Vale, were they able to clear out the Grim? Things at Vale are under control. But the school? It's, yeah, it's not that simple. That thing, whatever it is, doesn't seem to be dead. Don't get me wrong, you did a number on it, but it's not disappearing. It's... Wait, so the Grim are still just there? Kind of frozen. I know that doesn't sound too bad, but so she... it keeps attracting more Grim to the school. I did what? Hmm? You said I did a number on it. What do you mean? Yeah, what was that power? I... Look, that's not important right now. We can talk. Well, it, it, it's very important. You can't just uh, what? You can't just glance over the fact that uh, that, that she uh, did whatever she did. Talk about it later. Things are just kind of a mess. It's always a mess. <sighs> Mind if we have a minute? What? I can't stay here. Ty, please. I'm glad you're all right. And the tattoo on his on his oh his right arm. It's like a mask. But it doesn't seem like a white fang mask. So, how you feeling? Um, Pretty awful probably. I kind of hurt all over. <laughs> that makes sense after what you did. You guys keep saying that that I did something. What are you talking about? What's the last thing you remember? Oh. I ran up the side of the tower, and when I got to the top, I... <gasps> Pira! Is she... Dead. She's gone. I... I... I got to the top, and I saw Pira! And Cinder! And then everything went white! Anything else? I remember my head hurting. The night you met Ozpin, what was the first thing he said to you? I, I, I don't know. I think it was something Probably about hello? silver eyes. Silver eyes? Yes. That's an extremely rare trait. So? You're special, Ruby. And not in the daddy loves his special angel kind of way. You're special the same way your mom was. Well, are we going to learn more about her then? Remnants full of legends and stories. Some of them true, some made up. But there's one Oz told me from a very long time ago. Back before Huntsman, before Kingdoms, it was said that those born with silver eyes were destined to lead the life of a warrior. Oh. You see, the creatures of Grimm, the most fearsome monsters mankind had ever encountered, were afraid of those silver-eyed warriors. Oh. They were the best of the best. It was said that even a single look from one of these fighters could strike a Grimm down. <laughs> it's a ridiculous story. You think that I might be... I mean, you have the silver eyes. You have the special powers. So, yes. Oh, a giant monster is currently frozen on top of Beacon Tower. And you're here, safe in bed. Wait. So wait, she just froze the place? You know what Ospin said to me. The night we met. Yeah, that's also what I was wondering about. Was he there? All missions I go on, all the times I'm away in some far off place, it's been for Ozpin. But he's missing now. 
Something's been set in motion. And with Oz gone, I'll have to pick up where he left off. Then what can I do? If I'm so special, then I can help, right? <sighs> you really want to help? Get some rest. You're that's, in no condition to go in. That's genuinely, <laughs> yes. That's, yeah. <coughs> yeah. Anyway, right now. That's genuinely the best way she can help. Just resting and getting better. Because if she's gonna try to do anything else, then she, you know, then she's not gonna be able to recover. Our enemy's trail leads all the way to Haven. That'd be quite a trip for a pipsqueak like you. Catch you later, kiddo. I like Rose so much. Yeah. Ruby. I just doesn't know what to do anymore. I'm so glad you're okay. But I'm not. Oh. It's all gone. The school. Penny. Pura. And... Ospin. Yang, where are Weiss and Blake? Weiss's father came for her. What? What do you mean? She got pulled out of school? No one outside of Vale knows what happened here. Before the tower fell, the last thing people saw was Atlas attacking innocent people and Grim destroying the city. Everyone's scared. No one knows who to trust. So Weiss's father came to take her back to Atlas. Where he thinks it's safe. She's gone. What about and Blake ran. Sun saw her go. After we got to the city, she just ran. But why? Well what I don't know. <laughs> so it's even worse than we thought. Huh. What now? Like genuinely how do we even like, I know we have to get back up and get stronger again and regroup and all this stuff, but how? How do you begin such an impossible task? And I don't care. There has to be a reason she... No, there doesn't. Sometimes bad things just happen, Ruby. So what do we do now? That's... I don't know. You <laughs> I could do whatever you want. I'm gonna lie here. Yang. Just leave me alone. I mean, she, Ruby, she actually needs time alone. She needs to think about this because she also doesn't know what to do now. I love you. A sunflower. Yeah. And Yang always looked so strong. Now she's just defeated. So it's been a while now. John. Hey, John. So it was fall before, and now it's it's winter. Haven's a long way to go. I know. It's the only lead we have. And you're sure you want to come along? The journey will be perilous. Oh. And whether we'll find answers at the end is entirely uncertain. But we wouldn't be here if we weren't up for it. Then let's get started. Let's go. A smaller, more honest soul. It's true that a simple spark can ignite hope. Breathe fire into the hearts of the weary. The ability to derive strength from Yeah, <laughs> Stash is just gone. Dad, I wish it be the ruby. Is undoubtedly mankind's greatest attribute. Which is why... I will focus all of my power to snuff it out. 
How does it feel? Knowing that all of your time and effort has been for nothing. It's painful. That your guardians have failed you. That everything you've built will be torn down before your very eyes. Your faith in mankind was not misplaced. Yeah, I mean, and rebuilding it is, is useless. Like, let's be honest. Together. Well, no, 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 it's not. It's not. Because this is the academy and this is a city. Unified by a common enemy, they are a noticeable threat. But divide them. Place doubt into their minds. And any semblance of power they once had will wash away. Of course, they won't realize it at first. Like you, they'll cling to their fleeting hope, their aspirations. But this was merely the first move. Yeah, that's also what I was expecting. This is just the first part of so their you plan. Send your guardians, like your so much more is still coming. And when they fail and you turn to your smaller soul, where is this? Know that you send what is this to place? The same pitiful demise. What is this? That's an alien. And this is not on Earth. Like, are we in hell? This is like the underworld? This is the beginning. And this is, this is an alien. And it has a very weird shaped head with tentacles or bones. I'm not sure. The end, Ospin. Spin. Like, this is not Cinder, is it? And I can't wait to watch you burn. Damn, Osman has enemies. To watch you burn. Wow. This volume was phenomenal. Just look at the post credit scene. Look how long it is. You know, that many people worked on it for a reason. Now, post credit scene. Who's this? A oh, crow. And that's Osmond's weapon. Okay. I guess he's following them. As a crow. Um, <clears throat> this was the end of volume three of Ruby. And this was just phenomenal.